SD Prep Track. We are here with Jaron Farnham of Del Norte right here. Unofficial 423 in the 4x16 100 earlier today and second place in the 1500, 408 to La Costa Canyon star. Uh, Jacob Stanford, Garrett Stanford? Garrett. Garrett, okay, there we go. Um, Jaron, do you want to tell us? Okay, <laughs> one of the Stanford twins. Um, yeah. uh, Jaron, do you want to tell us about your race today? Um, honestly, I didn't know what to expect going into it. I was I was just trying to race it like a 1200 and then just try to hang on the last 300 meters. Uh, but every 400 meters, that, that goal just kept slipping a little bit away. I was trying to hit 65s, but uh, I think I did like 66, 66, 67, or something like that. Okay. Uh, I'm not sure. Okay. Um, but like, I don't know. It, it was interesting. <laughs> okay. So yeah, seeing obviously both Sanford twins, Mario Trezvina, Jack Lovermona, all those guys up in the race today. How did your race um, go in comparison to your expectations coming out here today? Expectations? Uh, I really I really don't know. Like I I was hoping to, to win. Just just try to get the, the win in the in the record books but um, you know I'm still very happy with the with the performance because it's a uh, I broke the school record by there we go. Uh, seven seconds. Okay was it Cam's or who was it? No it was uh, Matthew Ernie's. Matthew Ernie's got it. Okay yeah, yeah. sounds good and obviously um, the 1500 being not the the, not the most typical event right there for most high school runners as we, we do the 1600. Do you want to tell us how much different that feels, even that 100 meters less, how much different that makes in your race right here, and your it, strategy? It's crazy, like it, it's way different. Like the starting on the straightaway is a huge like disorientating mm -hmm. type thing and just like and especially seating right there has yeah. a big factor in your race as well right yeah. there, right? And for some reason just like 100 meters less, it just makes you feel like you need to sprint a lot more. <laughs> and like, because since it's like a shorter race, it just, it just feels more like a 1200 than it does a 1600. Gotcha. So, I don't know, it's weird. All right, sounds good. And then, um, obviously, looking forward to head to May this year. Um, do you have any individual goals you'd like to share with us, Jaren? Oh, uh, well, I'm hoping to get into the the night heat of the Arcadia two mile. Okay. And I know it's a it's a really big goal, but I'm I'm trying to break nine. Sounds that's, good. That's my goal. Awesome. Well we wish you the best of luck this season, Jaren, and good job today. Thank you.